When it comes time to export your course from Blackboard and import into Canvas, this is what you need to do. In your Blackboard course, go to Packages and Utilities. When you click on that, it will expand a menu and you will go to Export Archive Course. Then what you will do is click Export Package. Everything at the top, leave it as it is. And down here, you can select which materials you want to export. If this is your first time exporting your course to put it into Canvas, just select All. And then click Submit. It will take uh, a minute or maybe more. It just depends on the size of your course to be able to render a zip file. This one I rendered just a few minutes ago. So you will click and your computer will download the zip file. Once it does so, it will, you can open it. So this is an example, I'll open this one. And then what you're going to want to do is find that zip file and rename it. Oops, there we go. Use the underscores so that you don't have any issues with name conventions. So make sure and name it whatever your course is. Okay. All right. Now what we're going to do is close this and go into Canvas. This is a blank shell with the master course template already added in, but everything is blank. We're going to go to settings. On the right hand side, import content. In this drop down menu, we're going to click Blackboard 6789 export zip file. We're going to find that zip file. Here we go. And double click on it. You can do all content from the zip file or specific content from the zip file. If we chose this on another screen, it will ask you what from that zip do you want to bring in. But I'm going to choose all content. You can also adjust events and due dates. But honestly, when you're moving from Blackboard to Canvas, I wouldn't do this. Just leave it alone and uh, make the due dates what you want later on. Click Import. The amount of time this takes also equals the size of the zip file. So I'm going to pause this briefly. When Canvas is actually running it, you'll see it say this, running, and then you'll have a status bar. I'm going to pause this again. That took a couple of minutes for my course. If there are any issues, it'll tell you that there are issues. You can click on those issues And this is, seems to be related to maybe a quiz. Uh, let's see what happens if I click on it. Oh, I see. This is for an evaluation. OK, so let's see what happened when this imported. So nothing came on the home page. Let's go to the modules and see what happened. So that's all part of the template. OK. Wow. It actually created modules for my weeks in Blackboard. This is so exciting. Oh my goodness, how awesome. Okay, this is very exciting folks, very, very exciting. 
someone else is going to take uh, the video from this point forward and show you how we like to call fluff and fold to get the course ready to be taught.